Damn. That sucked. <laughs> All right. Russell. Like sixty miles left, I think. Ain't shit. Damn boy. This looks like the place uh I left Lily. Ugh. Sixty three miles to go. Can I hold down shift to run? No. Ah, I missed the days of taking shortcuts. Yeah, no taking shortcuts. Hey! You getting up? Doesn't look like it. Good. I should probably hurry. Oh. Shit, shit, shit. What's that? Truck, height. Oh, yuck. Fucking gross, man. I see you cuddling with your girlfriend down there. <laughs> Shit. Bro. I don't want no trouble. Please. You just want to be left alone with your friend down there? No, just leave me alone. Look, I don't care what you do to whatever corpse you find. I wasn't... What's your name? Russell. So you didn't steal that bag. I don't care who you steal from, if you did. Maybe you're in a gang that likes to rob people. I don't know. Are you in a crew? You got some boys wearing hoodies I gotta worry about? Because you steal from me and I'll get your throat out. I don't care who you run around with, you understand? It's mine. I didn't steal it. Alright, good. I don't like thieves. Just get in the car. You're gonna get eaten out here otherwise and I'm bored. Come on. Scoot. I ain't gonna wait forever. Fine. Fuck. See if I give a shit. Okay. Yeah. I'd like a ride. That'd be good. Thanks. Hell yeah! Get in! Let's tear it up! I'm trying to get to my grand's house. Fuck, she liked to party? Just get in. We'll get there. Or somewhere. Eventually. Name's Nate, by the way. Thanks for asking. You thirsty? Uh... Here you go. Uh, no. I'm straight, thanks. You're not uptight, are you? Is this the fucking apocalypse? This is like nothing. No, I'm just good, all right? All right, all right. You want to tell me about where you come from, at least? Must have been with it. Any tailback where you come from? Maybe drop you off, do a double back. Can we just drive? We? Oui. You want to sit on my lap? I oh. just don't want to talk. You're a tough little nut, Russ. Creepy. Look, man, I'm sorry if I freaked you out at first. We all got our way of coping with shit, right? I guess I can come across a bit... Ah, whatever. I guess. There you go. Relax. We're gonna have some fun. 
Why don't you tell me where you were before you got here? Fine. There were seven of us. I didn't have any family there or nothing. They were all my grands down in Statesboro. There was a dad who had a daughter about my age. One guy said he used to be a cop, but nobody really believed him. Then a teacher and his wife. The leader was this guy, Steve. Go back to the daughter. Steve was a bad dude, but everybody was with him, you know? He said seven was the magic number, so we didn't add nobody to the group. If we found survivors, it was the same every time. He... He... Let it out, Paco. Just... We gonna kill these folks and take this stuff or what? Then bang! They'd be dead. Anyway, I, I couldn't handle that. After weeks of it, I packed my shit up and figured I could make for Grands alone and try to find my family. I slipped out of there. I couldn't live like that. So nobody got down with the daughter then? No, they didn't. What would you give her? Strong six? Just tell me something about her. How was the rack? Give me a little something. Just a taste. Russ, I'm doing you a service here. I gotta get my beak wet. I'll put it right in here. Why you gotta be like that? Like what? Always talking about women like that. Women? <laughs> okay, well, let, let me see if I can answer your question. Because, because the hunger a man's got for a woman is all we got left now. No laws, no jobs, ain't nothing that make us men. But they ain't eating all the women yet. Whatever. Let's try this again. All right, maybe someone who wasn't so near and dear to your heart then. What the fuck? Come on, scale of one to ten. What do you think? Ah, Slam it before she was What the right? hell? What do you think? Here, get a look. Ooh. Fuck! Ah, like ah, a nine, ah, right? Get off me! Maybe you got high standards. Oh, hell! If you say five, I'm gonna flip. Ah, Tell me, Russ. Ah, ah, Jesus, Russ, calm ah, down. Damn it. Did you load that? Bullets in the glove there. What the hell was that? Let's look for some supplies in here. See if we can fill up while we're at it. Don't be mad. Fine, be mad. Just stop being a pussy. Alright. Oh shit! What Go! The hell? Get out! What the? Bus! Get the fuck down, man! You don't want to be there! Get to the truck! I'll cover you! I'll get fucking shot! No, you won't! I'll cover you! This guy can't hit the broadside of a barn! Just move your ass! Oh, shit. Holy crap. Good hustle. What happened to I'll cover you? Look how good you did. All right. What are we going to do? First, we're going to figure out exactly where this asshole is. Just get a quick glance. <laughs> it's me again? Down! Woo. See? Easy. Now we know where he is and we can fucking get him. All right. Yeah. That's the spirit. Let's push this truck for cover. Okay. It's in neutral. Just keep your head down. Shit! Just keep pushing! Oh, that's not gonna work. Ugh. Shit! Push! Uh, uh, the end of the road. 
What now? We're gonna get around the side of the building. We gotta go from cover to cover. Seriously, this time. I'm not fucking around. You gonna cover me? If we get to that car, we'll be out of the line of fire. Here. You can cover me first. I'm not fucking around. You cover me, then I'll cover you. Or if you want to go first, that's fine too. I'll cover you. You go first. Just shoot at the window and keep that fucker's head down till I get where I'm going. Then throw me the gun, and I'll do the same. Ready? Yeah. You ready, Russ? Cover my ass now. Remember, don't stop shooting. Fire! All right, throw me the gun, and I'll cover you! Go! Ooh. Holy shit. Good job! Now what? We get over there, and we should be good. Go! Ooh. Holy crap. Thanks. We're not done yet. Let's see if we can get in around back. Sneak up on this asshole. Follow me. Man, what are we doing? Well, we gotta get in there. Fucker shot at us. Russell, relax, man. When this is over, we're gonna take what we can, head on down to your grams, and have a big old home-cooked meal, all right? Come on. Watch out for that. What's the problem? We should put it out of its misery. It's fucking dead. Come on. Feel like a big man now? Let's go. Okay, it's clear. Keep your head down and follow me. You got it. All right. We're gonna be fucking quiet. We're gonna sneak up on this son of a bitch and take him out. You hear me? Not a fucking beep. Let's go. I see him. Check through the window. See if there's anyone else. Oh, well, I guess not. I think I saw a guy. here you monsters whoa gramps i told you not to come back here think you could just leave your mask at home and now you're with this fucking spook first off watch the fucking racism this is my boy secondly i don't fucking know you we were just passing by like anyone else bullshit you came back to finish us off and take all our food you've lost your goddamn marbles she's dying and now she can see your face we've never been here sir then who shot my wife? Wasn't us. You tried to kill us for no goddamn reason. If anything, we should take you out for that. Please, just get the fuck out of here. Please, leave us alone. What do you say, Russ? Should we just kill these folks and take all their stuff? <laughs> Look at that face. 
Are you serious? Maybe. Why not? That's fucked up! There are real fucking monsters out there! No shit. And you're just gonna joke about the shit I seen! Fuck you, Nate! I saved your ass! You didn't do shit! Easy, Russ. I'm not hurting no one. And don't you hurt these people either. Come on! Can we still be friends? No. Oh, shit. <laughs>